What's going on guys? Chris here with Tactical Outdoorsman and today we're going to be talking about the Bushnell Banner 2. So stick around. Alright guys, here we have it. Uh, the Bushnell Banner 2. Okay? Uh, I have this guy mounted on top of a Remington 770. Uh, this is probably one of the cheapest, oldest rifles that I have. Uh, it's chambered in 30-06. Uh, it's nothing fancy, but uh, I worked up a custom load for it, uh, I free floated it, and it shoots accurately. So, uh, until it fails or breaks, I'm going to continue to use it. So, let's talk a little bit about the Banner 2 uh, scope here. So, we'll take the uh, covers off. Alright, uh, so, this guy is custom made for hunting, okay? It's purpose built, and that's what this is for. So... It uh, doesn't have any fancy bells or whistles, no illuminated reticles, uh, or anything like that. Um, the body comes in a one piece uh, of aluminum. Uh, it's waterproof, it is fog proof, and uh, the lenses are coated and has their dusk to dawn lenses, uh, which are supposed to be great for shooting in low light scenarios, um, as opposed to uh, regular lenses with the classic coatings. So, uh, this guy is a 3 to 9 by 40, and the reticle is what they call a DOA reticle, okay? So we'll take a look at that, and we'll talk a little bit about what that means. Now, uh, one of the things that you're going to be able to do with the Banner 2 is go and download their ballistic app. So, one of the things about this optic is it is for hunting, and the app allows you to put in the data on the ammunition that you're going to be shooting so that the bullet drop uh, points in the reticle can coincide with certain distances. Okay, So uh, you could put in whatever your hunting cartridge is and the hash marks in the scope, uh, so the DOA for drop of angle. Um, there is five, five points in there of drop with a hash on each drop point for a five mile per hour wind call in either direction. All right, so uh, when you get that information put into your ballistic calculator, uh, it'll calculate the velocity of the bullet and the drop um, over distance out to 500 yards, okay? Uh, there is no parallax on this optic. Uh, this is just a fixed uh, parallax at 100 yards, so um, even less things to tinker with. So. All you really need to do is worry about your magnification and you need to hold, uh, know your holdovers, all right? which you'll get out of that app. So let's go and take a little bit closer look at this uh, optic. We'll throw it up on the bench and go over it in a little bit more detail. All right, so let's take a look at what we have here. Uh, we have the turret covers, so let's unscrew these real fast. Okay, let's set those aside. All right, um, so right now I have this zeroed for 100 yards. You can hear the clicks. They're nice and audible, okay? It has a, a good feel to it. Um, now, these don't have zero stop turrets, so uh, you can't, uh, like some of the more expensive optics, you can't lift them up, uh, turn them to zero and put them back in, or you can unscrew them, move it to zero and screw them back in, so they just are set that the way that they are. Um, here's your magnification, so you have your 9 all the way down to your 3 power, okay? Uh, there's no adjustment on the, uh, on the eye relief here, so that is fixed. Uh, this does come with the two mounts that you see on here, so they'll attach to your regular Picatinny rail uh, via a screwdriver, okay? So nothing special or fancy here, uh, just gets the job done. All right, uh, so what I want to do is um, I wanted to put this on a 30-06 because I wanted to sight this in and I wanted to show that it's going to hold zero on a larger caliber. Um, so you don't have to worry about it losing zero. Um, it's built for these uh, some of these larger calibers. So you don't have to think that because the price point on this optic is only about 90 bucks. Um, you know, some people might think, oh, I'm only going to put it on a 22, or I'm only going to put it on a 223. It'll hold up just fine on uh, on the, you know, streamlined hunting calibers uh, like this 30-06 here. So, 
Uh, let's get out on the range. Uh, I want to sight this in, and I want to see what kind of groups I can get together with it with my hand loads. Okay, so let's get out there. Let's see what happens. Let's see. All right, we're back. So uh, this is my sight in target. So when I was zeroing, uh, I started here, and then I started to walk it up, and then from there I just started to uh, tighten up the groups a little bit. Okay. So uh, I was really just getting zeroed in, and when I got close enough. Uh, on the other side of here, uh, this was my my final group that I shot. Okay, so it's down here. It's just about a minute of angle. Um, you know, perfectly adequate for a hunting rifle. But uh, just so you know, you know, you know what I was getting out of it. Um, the scope wasn't losing zero. Okay, uh, the you know one MOA group at a hundred yards. Uh, you know, could I tighten it up? Probably. Uh, I could probably be a better shooter, and I could probably work my loads up a little bit better. But uh, that's the accuracy that I'm getting out of it. So just to show you guys that with the 30 out six, uh, you're not going to knock your zero off on this scope, in spite of the relatively inexpensive price. If you were worried about that, okay. All right. Uh, when you get this scope, it's going to come with a little card like this. And it gives you some general information on here. So uh, basically it gives you an explanation on how to use the DOA reticle. Let me just get a little bit closer, see if we can get into focus here. Okay. And it gives you a list of common hunting calibers that you can use with this. Okay. Uh, let's get a little bit closer on the reticle here. So it shows you the different drop points and the line going through them again is for a five mile per hour crosswind in either direction um, when you go and you download the app okay this is what the app is going to look like uh, you'll put your information in for your cartridge and it'll tell you what distance each of those drop points are going to be for the cartridge that you're going to be shooting okay so you guys can download this uh, this is a free app so it's not going to cost you anything all right, guys, there you have it. That's the Bushnell Banner 2. Uh, if you're in the market for an inexpensive hunting scope, uh, this guy comes in at just under $90. Uh, it's got a, a lifetime warranty. Um, it's a uh, warranty to fix, not replace, uh, but it does have that warranty. So if you are looking to get into hunting and you're not looking to drop a ton of money, this might be a good option for you. I hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll see you in the next one.